Who the fuck are you? No, the fuck you're not. I'm done. I'm done. I just remember asking the cops and the ambulance, I was like, why me? Why me? Why me? Why did this happen to me? Why me? And I remember the cop was super nice about it. He was like, gave me a hug and he was like, things like this just happened. You need to go get some rest. I got in my car. I cried. I was holding my face crying for like 20 minutes before I could pull away. Right here. Let's go this way. Let's go this way. Let's go this way. Because this door should be open. <laughs> if the door is open, I'm going to let her walk in and get her dad. Awesome, no, who the fuck are you? Who the fuck is this? I'm dying. I'm dying. Who the fuck are you? No, the fuck you're not. I'm dying. I'm dying. I'm dying. Le fait qu'elle soit si à l'aise dans votre maison en dit long. Et ce sourire sur son visage. Tout ira bien. Je sais que ça fait mal. Mais un jour tu réalises que tu mérites tellement plus. Elle pense que c'est drôle quand il va lui faire ça aussi. Une femme qui sort avec un homme sachant qu'il a une famille n'a aucun respect de soi. Bon courage à vous. Je suis tellement désolée que votre fille ait dû être là pour ça. Hey queen, so let's just jump right into part 3. So I left off when I had the two seizures. So right before the two seizures, I had called an ambulance and I, because I knew that I was about to have the seizure, I have stress induced seizures already as it is. So I was like, hey... I think I'm about to have a seizure. I gave him the address. And at that point, I remember like dropping the phone and that was it. I was in the grass because he had told me to go outside. He's like, bitch, go, bitch, leave, go, go, go. So I was waiting in the grass. My kids were inside. And I remember seeing the girl at the door right before that. And then I woke up to him in my face. Over the first time, the first seizure, I literally got so scared. I put myself back into a second seizure. And then that's when I remember waking up again to the ambulance and him telling the girl, you need to go, you need to leave. 